Hey there, it's Nathalie, and I have created this coloring book page for our study that we're doing on Psalms 91, and I've opened it up in Photoshop, and uh, yes, you can uh, color this in with your markers or your pencils. I thought maybe if you wanted to color this in Photoshop, I would show you how. So I've opened it up. It's a JPEG. I have a little color palette down here. I've picked a light green here. You can pick any of the greens you want, and I'm going to use the photo, the, the paint bucket tool. And so I'm just going to grab a couple of little places for this light green to go there, maybe one more, and then we'll reopen that. Let's move it over this way and kind of darken it a little bit, and we'll put some there, and there, and there. And uh, so I want to put some in my leaves. So let me, I'm going to use the Control Plus. If you're on a Mac, I'm on a PC, you can um, do a Command and put in a couple of, oops, I touched, that's a good lesson because what I did is I touched the, the black line and that caused everything to go green. So, but what I want is to fill in this little space and I'm not going to, color them all that same green maybe this one and over here and I'm not going to color everything I'm just going to give you a little quick I don't want to do that one so uh, control Z to undo let me come down and put this one in and then uh, let me show you how to color the letters um, and I think I'm going to do a blue or Almighty, and the blue of the Talit. That is a prayer shawl. So as I'm thinking about this, uh, whoever dwells in the shelter of the uh, Most High will rest under the shadow of the Almighty. And so I have the shelter as the hoopa, or kupa, hoopa, uh, for the Jewish wedding and let me come back and get this green and we're gonna go just a little bit darker there we go oops that turned blue control Z let's get that green flip flop that color swatch thing there so there's my deeper green and let me back out and see I'm going to undo that one because I want that as a sky color. So let me do this one as the dark green. This one, come up just a little bit. There, there, not that, control Z. So you can see control Z, control, uh, uh, that's your undo. I want this to be, I've got this blue. I want this to be sky back here. So let me flip flop that down here in the corner and I want this a softer blue and maybe even just a little bit more turquoise or blue I think that one will be good so I'll do a little bucket fill there with the blue little sky there now whenever I do this it's going to color my background in there and all the little places that you think might be sky or background. You don't have to do like what I'm doing. You can choose your own colors. I think I'll make that tree. That's going to be sky right there and right there. All right, so if you have forgotten what color that you used, oh, let me get these filled in first. Control plus, bring this back up. So fill in those places. All right, now I'm fixing to wrap this one up. Let me go ahead and get a gra uh, grape color. And we'll do a couple of those. We don't want to do all of them in that same color purple because it just would make it like kind of boring. But so what I wanted to show you is like, uh, okay, in my color swatch down here, I don't I no longer have the blue. So, but I want you 
to get this blue again. So I'm going to use my dropper tool, grab the blue, and you can see right down here it changed that to that same blue. And so if I wanted to do uh, the most high, also in that same blue as, a, as the Almighty, there's my same blue as what I did Almighty in. All right? Whoops. How about undo that? There we go. Control minus is what I was after. So then you can just, you can color your tree. Let me give you one more thing. We'll color the tree. Uh, sometimes when it first opens up, you don't see your color exactly. We'll go right there. And maybe I don't want that quite so dark. Let's get that. And bucket fill in that tree. Then you can fill in your shadows, whatever color you'd like to do that. But in case you just did not want to do a coloring book page, but you want to add this to your journal, uh, this makes it easier for me to memorize and to get this scripture down in. Whoever is important to me, that's me. When I dwell in the shelter of the Most High, I can rest in the shadow of Almighty. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed this. I'd love for you to subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye.